You remember that scene we witnessed at the Vestige? That kind of stuff happens every day here. Silva has taken most of the humans who survived under his protection, so revenants are left to rely on blood beads alone to slake their unending thirst. But, well, nothing in this world lasts forever. The springs started to dry up, and so blood beads grew rarer and rarer. And the order Silva created by levying and distributing blood beads won't last much longer either. The world needs more blood beads. Only then can we strive for fairness instead of petty favoritism. That's why we've been exploring the Jail of the Mists. We're doing research to learn all we can about blood beads. But the miasma has been a real problem. It makes our thirst even worse, so our progress has stalled. Now, though, we have a glimmer of hope. Your power can clear the miasma. If you could help us... Well, we'd be drawn into a bitter conflict. Still, the truth is, we don't have a lot of hope without you. Will you join us? <sighs> Thanks. So, it's a done deal? <laughs> well then, from now on, you're one of us. Yakumo Shinonome. <laughs> I'll be looking forward to seeing you in action. Let's get right into it. Here's what's going on. We're studying blood beads and their springs. We want to know how and when blood springs appear, their cycles for producing beads, and the composition of the beads themselves. We've made a few discoveries. First of all, we found that there are tubes like capillaries running through the earth. We call them blood veins. And so far as we can determine, every single blood spring is located on top of one of these blood veins. Also, after comparing blood beads and blood veins, we now know that they are mostly comprised of the same substances. In other words, we can safely assume that blood springs always form along blood veins. We think that means there must be a source somewhere. A kind of headwaters for the blood beads. Now that we have you around to clear the miasma, we can investigate the springs and follow the blood veins. And hopefully, find the source. Right? We want to check out the old city ruins first. Sorry for the rush, but we should head out as soon as you're ready. That's something. <laughs> Expectations exceeded. That settles it. You are absolutely vital to our operation. There are more blood springs ahead, but the miasma is blocking the way forward. Do you think you could clear it for us again? Thank you. We know where two springs are thanks to past expeditions. Let's go have a look at them. The territory up ahead is teeming with the lost. Watch yourself. Hey, what is it? You okay? 
Yo, Louie. You smell that? Yeah. Human blood. An escapee? Now, where did she run off to? Huh? Hey, chumps! What the hell are you doing here? None of your business. Oh, really? Then tell me this. Why would scum like you have the sweet stink of a human on you? The girl belongs to us. Put your paws on our property and your ash. That clear? <sighs> Fresh blood is some powerful stuff. You hanging in there? So, what's the plan now? We know it's just a matter of time until they find that missing human. You know the plan. Hell yeah. Let's hope she hasn't been devoured by horrors yet. Let go of me! We lost the race. Well, strength succeeds where speed fails. Wait! This place is... Hurry it up, damn wretch! Without your blood, we'll all suffer! Or didn't you think about that when you ran off? Take him somewhere safe. You owe me for this.
break. You? I remember you. Where's the girl? Answer me! Where did you take her? We're taking custody of the girl. That human belongs to us. We will take her back. Oh. Humans aren't property. They have the same right to live that any of us do. Don't give me that noble act. They have no rights. And why shouldn't we feed on them? We're the ones keeping them safe after all. Why were we kicked out of our graves? Who did we die for again and again at the Queen's hand? We writhe with this terrible thirst. We live in fear of joining the ranks of the lost. And for whose sake? It's all in the service of humans. If blood is the only price they have to pay, then they have a pretty good deal. That doesn't mean you can just do whatever you want with them. And what about the rights of revenants? Huh? It's not like we're choosing to live this way because it's such a barrel of laughs. That should be enough to get you through a month or so. Whoa, whoa, hold on a minute. Just make sure that you and I never cross paths again. This is your one and only warning. No way. The Crimson Sword? I guess we'll be rationing for a while. Oh, well. What is lost can be found again, huh? I swear I'll end it. The Revenant's suffering must end. Okay, we can trace the flow of the blood beads from here. Just a sec. Give me a moment to finish this, then we can head out. Our destination is this way. This should get us there. We set? All right then. I know you're there. What are you? Stay back! I'm the one who decides how I live! I won't listen to you anymore! That's fine. Just put down the knife. I'm sick and tired of it! Day after day, having my blood sucked by every passing revenant! I'm not an animal! You're right. And we can help you. I know someone who can take you to one of the government shelters for humans. If you ask, they'll take you in and you'll be able to live in safety. What? You won't have to spend your days living in fear of revenants anymore. Although you will be asked to donate blood. It's... It's a trick. Do you really think I'm going to fall for that? Everything you need to know is on that paper. You're the one who decides how you live. But why? I think the time for sacrifices is over. That's all. All right, we should hurry. <laughs> 